So, moving on. Um, things are still looking a bit ragged around the Scottish border. So I thought what we needed to do is create some new earldom, uh, put all the major castles under that, and get someone to really organise and streamline the whole operation. <laughs> so, uh, who's up for that, then? Sire, as your foremost northern lord, I feel, perhaps, I may be best placed Ooh. to... Really? I thought this might be one for Lucentio. <laughs> what, again? Problem? Well, no, I, I, I just think that Lucentio's got quite a lot on his plate at the moment. Has he? Well, yes, he, he's Lord Chancellor, Archbishop of Canterbury, Lord High Admiral, Lord Privy Seal. <laughs> Stop it. Keeper of the royal money, taster of the royal cake, king's most favourite fellow, chief wardrobe advisor and plague czar. <laughs> I mean, he is our top guy. I mean, no offence, fellas, but, you know, I always say, my other barons bring me problems, Lucentio brings me solutions. <laughs> what was that, Northumberland? Uh, nothing. With respect, Your Majesty, what solutions? I, I mean, what, what's he actually done? I don't know where to start. I mean, what hasn't he done? All right, what hasn't he done? <laughs> he hasn't won a war with France. <laughs> now, now, that wasn't Lucentio's fault, was it? The French were on bloody good form that day. <laughs> bloody good form. And you've got to hand it to them. What? Normandy. <laughs> we had to hand it to them. Well, yes, yes, all right. But, I mean, come on, guys. I mean, you all like Lucentio, yeah? Um, um. <laughs> I mean, you all like Lucentio as much as I do, right? <laughs> I don't think we all like him quite as much as you do. <laughs> well, he speaks very highly of you, Warwick. I've really come to see Warwick as a friend. He was saying that to me just the other day, weren't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, thanks. Um, thanks, Lucentio. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> see? That's better. Good. Right, so Lucentio is Earl of the Northern Marches. Right, what's next? Oh, yes. Okay, so it's Lucentio's half-birthday next week. So, <laughs> who's got a daughter who's a virgin? So, HMS Lucentio it is. Good name. Right, so I think that just about wraps it up for today. Um, uh, can I have a quick word, Your Majesty? Yes, of course. See you in a minute, Luch. It, it's, it, it's about Lucentio. Oh, good. Isn't he great? Uh, yeah, yeah, but, um, well, what, what we were all wondering is whether you might like to have sex with him. <laughs> What? Have sex with a man? What are you talking about? Well, it, it's a bit left field, I know, but, but hear me out. OK. What we were wondering is, is what it is you like about him. Well, he's just so brilliant. I mean, you know, he, he's full of ideas, he's just so good at stuff. He's committed, he's, he's a team player, he, he's just a great guy to have around. Right. And you're sure it's not just that you'd, you'd quite like to, you know, really give him one? <laughs> No, I don't think so. Well, well, I just wanted to say that, that if it was that, then we'd all be fine about it. I mean, I mean, technically, we, we think it means you'd go to hell, but, you know, <laughs> that's, that's long-term, and, and we totally support you. Right. Because just think about this. Are, are you absolutely 100% that instead of giving him every important job in the kingdom, many of which he has, to put it nicely, completely screwed up, <laughs> you, you wouldn't rather just have a bit of a massive sweaty tumble with him? While the rest of us, you know, sort out the admin. Oh, I see. And, and it would mean that Lucentio was a lot less busy, was, was away a lot less. He's always away. <laughs> I miss him when he's away. I can't really sleep. So what I'm saying is... He smells good, I will say that. <laughs> right, so... God, he smells good. <laughs> yes, so... What's stopping you? Do you think he'd be interested? Well, he, he, he barely touched Northumberland's virgin. That's true. I think you're definitely in there, Your Majesty. You think? Yeah, but, but remember, just to have sex with him and not to give him loads of important jobs. <laughs> OK, well, uh, wish me luck. <laughs>